Hello, I am Melee. Today I am ranking exotic weapons in Fortnite, and I am rating from trash to overpowered. Let's dive in. First we have the Nighthawk Revolver is categorized as an average weapon because it features a sniper-like scope, but its body damage is only 44, making it less effective overall. Can you get the shot off? 44. 44 from this range? Holy! Another 44! That's some big damage! Oh gosh, this guy's staring at me. I can't see, he's on sand. Okay, I found a weakness to this revolver, and it's that on sand, it blends in. 44 again, 44 again. He's not liking that. He's found the weakness. When he's in the sand, I cannot see. I will shoot you. Back away, Gump. Back away, Gump. I have hit this guy so much. Next up is the Shadow Tracker, a pistol that deals 43 damage. If your accuracy is on point, you can easily dominate your opponents with it. So I'm placing this in the average. Oh, look at that. There's a build fight there. Come on. Let me get over there. Let me see if I can tag this guy. Oh. Crack. Absolutely crack. Okay, I've got everyone on my thing now. <laughs> I can kind of see everybody. I've got two of them. I actually think there's a third one. Oh, you see this guy right here? Look. I, bro, I can't even see him properly. I'm just shooting him because I can see him through the marking. Kinda cheap. Next is the Six Shooter, a revolver that deals 88 headshot damage and is one of the coolest exotic revolvers. However, its downside is the limited six bullet capacity. So I'm placing it in very solid. So much fish. Okay, let's eat a slurp fish, let's eat a shield fish. Oh my gosh, relax. Let's grab all these other fish. 21 damage to the body. 88 to the head? Oh my gosh. All right, well, you're gonna want to hit your headshots with this thing, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> it's kind of insane if you hit headshots. Next, we have the Hesitant Blink Mag SMG. There's no need to say much about this beast weapon. It's a fan favorite in shooting games. I'm placing it in the overpowered. Like right on the side. I don't think they know that I'm here. Oh. I'm behind you, bro. <laughs> Exotics, baby! That's how we do! The dual pistols deal 43 damage per shot, totaling 86 damage. These pistols are some of the coolest in the game, so I'm placing them in the god tier. Forty-three, forty-three. that's 86 for the double body shot. That's really not bad at all. I'm gonna use the purple tack for this. The pulse rifle is a laser gun that deals 33 damage to the body and 67 to the head, so I'm placing it in the very solid. Oh my god. Oh, that's so hot. <laughs> Hold up, bro, what? I just took out two players like it was nothing, man. The grappler bow is useful both in combat and for rotation. With a body damage of 89, I'm placing it in the good. Oh. Right there, right there, right there. I'm gonna hit him with it. Oh! Oh! You can hit him straight with it! Man, this guy upgraded every gun he had. Ah! Go crazy! Go stupid! I'm flying out of any, anything, man. I gotta, I gotta fly with this bow. The heisted explosive assault rifle deals 30 body damage per bullet, and its unique feature is that it shoots explosive rounds. I'm ranking this one in the god tier. How many shots going on? The heisted run and gun SMG stands out for its incredible fire rate. With 18 body damage and 27 headshot damage, I'm placing this in the good. Get back here. The dub is a weapon with very low range and a very small magazine. The dub can deal high amounts of damage in very close situations. It's me. Hello, buddy. 
I just keep, keep jumping back. Oh, wrong, wrong double barrel. Oh my gosh, this is insane. So I am placing it on average. Next is the Hesitant Accelerant Shotgun. Its fire rate increases as you shoot, making it nearly unstoppable if your opponent doesn't react quickly. It's one of the best shotguns in the game, so I'm placing it in the overpowered category. That is so fast, look at this, look at this, watch. Oh my god, this is sick. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> that is so cool. I love that you can move faster as well, guys. This is already one of my favorite weapons in the entire game. The Big Chill shoots out a chiller grenade that is affected by gravity and explodes on impact. It deals no damage, instead affecting those who shoot it with an ice effect, so I'm placing it on trash. The Boom Sniper Rifle fires a fast Klinger projectile. This Klinger deals contact damage to players and then explodes after a short time. I am ranking it on very solid. Oh, I stuck him! Oh! Yo, that's so cool! What did you just do? I just stuck him with the sniper rifle. Oh, I stuck him again! The Storm Scout Sniper Rifle fires fast-moving projectiles, always hitting the center of the crosshair with no damage fall-off. I'm placing it in the very solid. Just keep trying to snipe him out. Oh, that guy's got the Mandalorian Sniper. I got three people over here. Oh. In the head, 212. In the head again. Back to back. The Heisted Breach Shotgun works like the Heavy Shotgun, with extra damage to structures breaking fully built wooden walls in one shot. I'm placing it in the God tier. Oh my God, it doesn't destroy it, but that did a lot of damage. So let's see how many shots. It's gonna take four shots to destroy one armored wall. But honestly guys, this has gotta be one of my favorite guns in the game. The burst quad launcher deals up to 42 damage per rocket with a maximum of 84 per shot. So I am placing it on a spawn viable. Two shots like rapidly. Okay, so I'm gonna show you right now. As you can see right there, this thing is can be very annoying. I'm not gonna lie to you. Uh, if someone's boxed up or if someone's just been, you know, a sweat, you can actually use this thing to eliminate them. So yeah, I think this is pretty sick to be honest with you. The Dragon's Breath Sniper works like the bolt action sniper with a scope for long range shots, but only one bullet per magazine, making accuracy crucial. I am placing it on overpowered. Oh my gosh, I hit him with it. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. That wraps up my ranking of Fortnite's exotic weapons, from trash to overpowered. Let me know in the comments if you agree with my list or if you'd rank them differently. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more Fortnite content. Until next time, keep grinding, and I'll see you on the battlefield.